Experience the evolution of prototype modeling using weathering decals from weatheringsolutions.com. In this video, we take this highly detailed HO scale mechanical reefer from Inner Mountain and weather it to simulate four and a half decades in service. Referencing prototype photos, we pay special attention to rust, the patch repairs, and graffiti. Each of our unique products comes with instructions for best results. Additionally, you will need a gloss coat, a decal setting solution, a dull coat, and a few basic tools. Begin with washing your model with mild soapy water and rinse to remove any contaminants. In order to define the exterior bracing, supplemental weathering is added using a graphite-like powder applied using a medium paintbrush. The excess is then removed using a cotton swab leaving minimal contrast. This will simulate years worth of mold in the rain channels. Now it is necessary to seal our powder with a dull coat. Once the dull coat is dry, we apply the gloss coat, in this case, pledge full strength through an airbrush. We will be using selections from five different products in HO scale. Reefer Rust and Repairs, Spray Can Scribble Graffiti, Y2K Graffiti, Modern Graffiti, and Ichabod Graffiti. All five products used are also available in N scale. We are now ready to apply our decals. Place the decal in warm water for about 15 seconds. To help the decal conform to the vertical braces, we apply a dab of setting solution. Now remove the decal from the water. Lightly pinch and slide the film to offset the backing paper. Now land the offset edge of the decal to your desired location and slide the backing paper out and away. Make any final alignments with the help of a toothpick or a hobby knife. Using a cotton swab, press gently and roll across the decal to remove any air bubbles and press onto the bracelet. Repeat this process for the remainder of your chosen decals. Using a makeup applicator, Press to soften decals onto the model surface. Now we apply more Salva Set on the top side of the decals and let dry completely. Allow the setting solution ample time to dry completely before proceeding. Next, repeat the gloss coat step and allowing to completely dry. The final step now is to apply a dull coat.